Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. Wow, look at all these different fish are around. I never really been to this aquarium before. So many different types of species and whatnot. Man, the ocean's kind of scary now that you think about it. There's so many of these fishes that we don't even know about. Especially them sharks. Ugh. Them sharks are kind of dangerous. But luckily we're in these uh, little tunnels now, and they never break. Hopefully. And also, I didn't know my brand new teacher assistant wanted to take me out here on a little date now. Yeah, I'm calling it a date. I mean, what else would it be? After all, we did go to one of those uh, little chicken spots. We picked ourselves up a to-go order, and then we headed right over here. I consider that a date. <laughs> yeah, I mean, although it's not like a bad thing for us teachers to be going on dates and whatnot, I see this more as a, uh, a friendly type of date, you know, a date between friends and whatnot. Mm-hmm. Oh, speaking of that chicken, I still got some left over in this little container. You want some? Yeah, luckily it's those uh, little popcorn chickens. Uh-huh. Alrighty. Okay. Here you go. Say, ah. Uh... <laughs> oh, well, in all honesty, I haven't been on a date in quite a while now. Uh, I'm not really sure why. Probably because of my, well, size. <laughs> Not a lot of uh, girls out there like a, a, you know, a big fella like me, right? <laughs> oh, well, thank you. Thank you kindly. I very much appreciate the, the compliments. And I mean... I mean, comparable to me, well, you will, you'll build like a, like a god of some sort. I mean, look at you. You have great posture. Your physique is out of this world. And also, you just, are, well, in my opinion, you're drop-dead gorgeous. Mmm. And plus... You can put food away pretty good, and I do like me a person who can eat just like me. <laughs> mm -hmm. But, uh, if you don't mind me asking, why did you ask me to go on a date with you? Well, I mean, you being my whole new teacher, helper, and whatnot, I've always looked up to people like that who always want to help out students and whatnot. Making sure that, uh, well, they're all put together and make sure that they're studying well and make sure that their quirks are working as attended do. And, well, uh, another thing is, well, with a kind-hearted soul like yourself, I just saw something in you that would be, uh, you know, nice to hang out with. And although you did ask me, so I'm pretty sure you're thinking the same way, right? About, about me and whatnot? Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, that's what I assumed. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that right there. Look at that giant stingray. Wow. You know, I've always been fascinated about the ocean, but also terrified at the same time. Because, like I said, there's so many species and whatnot inside of the ocean. And it's such a big place. Compared to us smaller people, we have no idea what's in the depths of the ocean. But these creatures are mighty fascinating to look at. Hey, you think fish like candy? Now think about it, think about it, really. <laughs> think about it. <laughs> I mean, everyone else likes candy. So, I mean, like, why wouldn't fish? Mm, that's true. Their taste buds might be different. And also, they do eat other fish, you know, the food chain and whatnot. I mean, yeah. yeah. I mean, it might be a little silly idea, but, you know, it's always nice to keep an open mind about things. <laughs> hmm. Well... Hmm, actually, now that I think about it, I don't remember the last time I went on a date. Like I said, it's been a while. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. I think, uh, when I was a bit younger than I am now, I think that was the last time I went on a date. Like in my mid-twenties or something. Mm hmm. It's been quite a long time, actually. But, we're here now. And, well, I'm happier than. Well, I'm happier than a cow that's going through a fresh patch of grass. <laughs> I don't think the students are gonna mind. And plus, most of my students now are, well, full-grown adults themselves. So, most of them must be going on dates and whatnot now. And plus, I think most of the older people, well, the other older students, they most likely have, like, wives and, like, maybe even children by now. Although it's been quite a minute since I've talked to Kirishima and, uh, Tamaki and all of them. I might give them a call just to surprise them. Or even, I might even go over to their places and maybe just visit with them for a while. Maybe have a few drinks with them, now that I can. <laughs> yeah, I feel like that would be a nice idea. Take them all out to the town, you know, get a few drinks, do some karaoke or something, and get some more tasty food. Speaking of, huh. <laughs> hmm. ah. you want you want another one? All right, here you go. That much my finger now. <laughs> You know, you're mighty pleasant to be hanging around. Yeah, I do enjoy your uh, company. And of course, you're mighty funny. And also, you just have a beaming glow up about you. Mm hmm. I do love somebody who can, like, you know, put a smile on somebody's face. And making sure that they feel all safe and protected and whatnot. Mm-hmm. You have pretty good potential becoming a pro hero yourself. So, why don't you? Why don't you try to be a pro hero? Mm-hmm. Hmm. 
Well, I mean, I, I guess you have a point there. Being a pro hero in one night isn't for everybody, and also it's quite a tough field to be working in. But I guarantee you, the out the outcome of like helping others and making sure that they're safe and always making sure that they feel safe and putting a smile on their face like you do to me, <laughs> I can tell you it's one of the best feelings in the world. So, uh, hmm, how about, how about this, all right? Once we're done walking around here and once you feel like we're done walking around here, why don't I take you back to the UA building and I can talk to Principal Nezu for you. So you'll be able to, like, sign up to be a pro hero of some sort. You know, start out and whatnot. Well, yeah, of course. You're my helper, after all. And plus, I want to see you prosper and make sure that you are the best you you could ever be. <laughs> well, all right then. Well, yeah, after you, I don't want to be rude. Alrighty. <laughs>